surviving every job for my daughter in 24 hours, starting with the Starbucks barista. Welcome to Starbucks. I need 20 pink drinks, stat. 20 pink drinks? Okay, that'll be $99. Thank you very much. There you go, and what name would you like on the order? The name's Do Your Job Faster. Do Your Job Faster. Thank you so much, Mr. Faster. I need to see what job is right for my daughter when she grows up, which means I need to try them all. Ooh. Ooh. But I've got this. All right, sir, your pink drinks are all done. If you just want to tap the screen anywhere. Not so fast. I need to taste that first. Okay, there you go. Oh, this is the worst pink drink I've ever tasted. There's way too much strawberry. I'm so sorry. I can remake it for you. No, I'm in a hurry. Come on, let's go. What? Me? I can't carry all these myself. Come on, bring them to my car. Okay. Oh, that customer was so rude. I don't want Zadie to have to deal with a person like that. You're going way too slow. My lane moves this way. Come on. Yeah, okay. Ah! What is wrong with you? You're the worst barista I've ever seen. I'm talking to your manager. Maybe that one's not the right job for Zadie. I instructor and I need to get my ballerina to listen to me. Are you ready to do this? Yeah. I need you to hold the bar and plie and up. Plie and up. Let's use this side. Plie and up. Now lift your leg. Woo! I'll go right here. Ready? Lift it up. Oh! Arms up and spin. Wow! You're so good at following instructions. You must have a good ballet instructor. Yeah. And run, run, run! Woo! And stop! Plie up! Plie up! Okay, ballerina, put your arms nice and point! And point! Whoa, you're listening! I think I did pretty good because my ballerina actually listened to me! I can't believe it! Now I'm an orthodontist for one of the biggest creators on YouTube. She's even bigger than Mr. Beast. It's like nausea! I have to take her braces off. Smile. Have you done this before? No, but you know what? It looks to me like your braces are ready to come off. I'm scared. Don't be scared. I'm a professional. Open your mouth, nausea. Okay. Ow! Sorry about that. You got big lips, okay? I'm just gonna pull these off. Can't be that hard, right? They're braces. They're just stuck on with glue. Three, two, one. Ah! I got them! <gasps> Is that my tooth? Oh. Uh... Don't worry, it's non toxic. It'll be fine. No! Ah! Okay, here, smile. Go like that. Just do it. Ah! I hope this works. Okay, now let it dry. Now smile. Voila! It worked. Your tooth's back. You should not be an orthodontist. Hey, you're right. I shouldn't, but maybe Zadie should. Or maybe Zadie wants to be a baby nurse. Hello, Zadie. I'm your baby nurse. I'd like to give your babies a check out. Zadie, do you want to check up? Are you sure? Because I have this for you. This is a sucker, and if you get a checkup from your baby nurse, then you get a treat. So can I test your heart? Your heart sounds really good. You have a lot of energy. You must make your parents pretty tired. Would you like a lick? You did a great job with your checkup. I'm gonna test a few more things. Your back. That sounds good. That sounds good. Let me check your babies. Zadie, do you want to be a baby nurse? Do you love babies? Mm. We know you love suckers. Sloth sounds good. So does troll. So does baby and Elmo. Looks like my job is complete as a baby nurse. That's all for now. High five. <claps> baby nurse. Oh, can you kiss the baby? Mm. Mwah. I'll see you later. Nurses are here to help. Bye. Let's finish. No, I'm a chef and I need to create the perfect First, I will add in the mushrooms. And the best part of being a chef is adding your special touch. I saw this on TikTok. Oh. <laughs> Maybe being a chef is not that cool, but you know what is? Being a firefighter. If you want to be a firefighter, here's your chance. Let's go. Okay. Look, the dog's stuck in the tree. We have to save him. I'll get the ladder. Okay, new girl. I'm coming to save you, dog. Faster, we don't have all day. I 
don't know if this is secure. Okay. Ah, I got him. Yay! I got him. How did he get stuck up there in the first place? He was chasing the cat. I am an archaeologist, and I need to identify the species of the bones that we find in here. I've got my assistant here. Here, help me dig for fossils. Come on, assistant. Let's dig. Wait, I think I found something. Here, brush it off, brush it off. <gasps> oh my gosh, let me take a look at this. Could it be a brontosaurus, a crustacean, or maybe a species that hasn't been discovered yet? Fish. <gasps> You're right. I was just checking to make sure you knew. I totally knew this was a fish. I'm a veterinarian now, and I have my patient here for their yearly checkup. Where'd he go? Hey. Oh, hello. Don't be scared. I am going to check your heart. Oh. I see you have a very strong heart. Let me take your temperature. Got it. You're good. Now let's weigh you. Stay. Good boy. Looks like you weigh 9.3 pounds, but last year you were 8.7. Too many dog treats, eh? Now I'm gonna test your mobility. Stretch. Good boy. Since you're a senior dog, I need you to eat some of this medicine, okay? Here. Oh yeah, that's a good dog right there. Kiss. Oh, we love a dog who loves their veterinarian. And finally, the ultimate dog test. Let's see if you have dog breath. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, we gotta do something about that one. I'm a lifeguard and I have to get a whistle. Why is the pool so empty? You're not a lifeguard. You're a junior lifeguard in training. If you want to be a real lifeguard, you need one of these. How can I earn that? Some people have been peeing in the pool. You gotta figure out who's doing it and kick them out. How do you know if someone's peed in a pool? Funny you should say that. We just got a new chemical that turns the water dark blue when someone's been peeing in it. Oh. I'm gonna go get a hot dog, but I'll be back. Okay, Zam Fam, I thought lifeguarding was a little more glamorous than this, but right now, I need to get that whistle and figure out who peed in this pool. And it looks like I have two options. Hello, girls! I say it's time that we all become friends here. We don't even know you. Stranger danger. No, 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 I'm a lifeguard. I wanted to spill some tea to you guys. I used to pee in the pool. Ew. Ew. Why would you do that? Gross. It was a long time ago, okay? Have you ever peed in a pool? No. Why would I do that? Uh, you? No. You look like you've peed in a pool once. That's so disgusting. Enough being nice. One of you two has peed in this pool, and I'm gonna find out who it is. Oh. We got pee in pool. Okay. Yeah. That's in a ghost plan, but I need to figure out which of those two girls peed in the pool so I can get that whistle. All I need now is some proof. That gives me an idea. One way to get someone to pee their pants is to scare them, and I'm gonna do it with this shark. Shark! 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 Baby shark out of the pool! Get out, you guys! Baby shark! There are no sharks in a pool. Besides. It's fake. That is a shark right there. I don't know how it got here. I see the remote behind your back. Ugh. If I can't scare these kids with a shark, then I'm gonna scare them another way. Get down in the water so I can see your pee! I'm telling my mom and I'm getting you fired. What? No, sorry about that. The net slipped. Didn't seem like it. That junior lifeguard is weird. Yeah, it's almost like she's trying to get us to pee in the pool like she does. I know, right? Are you trying to get us to pee our pants? No, of course not. Let me just get the snake right away. Where is it? Gotta turn dark blue. It's fake. You can never be too careful. What lifeguard brings a fake snake to work? <laughs> oh my goodness. Apparently weird ones like her. Scaring them into peeing their pants didn't work, but maybe they just weren't hydrated. Who wants a popsicle? I only have one, so first to finish their water wins it. Oh, you have to sit down in the water. On your marks, get set, go. Who wants a popsicle? If you feel anything coming out, just let me know so I can run away. This is close, who's gonna win the popsicle? The winner is, congratulations, your very own popsicle. Now just sit here, you feel anything? That was a lot of water. If I did, then I would go to the bathroom. Did you hear that girl? She said if she had to pee, she'd go to the bathroom. There's only one other way that I can think of to get someone to pee. I've pranked Matt before with this. It's a little warm water. Do you think this is gonna work? It has to. I bet you can't float with your hand in this water right here. I bet you I can for another popsicle. Fine, another popsicle. Just lay down and float. That's really warm water. You know, if you're feeling relaxed, you know, just let it loose. I think I won the popsicle. <sighs> 
<laughs> two. Wow, you know what? Your friend has two popsicles and you have none. And? And you could buy your own popsicle with this right here. Oh. Oh. Guess you'll have to get it out of this warm water. So, do you feel anything? I feel like that I can buy a popsicle with this. That's the pool bully. He doesn't want anybody in this pool except him. Please don't let him kick us out. Of course not, you guys. Just keep playing. Stop. Hey, hey, hey! No splashing! I said no splashing! I didn't hear a whistle. Oh, looks like you don't have a whistle, do you, new lifeguard? What's your name? Billy. Well, I hear that you don't want anyone else swimming in the pool with you. It's the only place I can swim. Why is that? Because I don't like rip ties and sharks, and mainly sharks. Let me get back to doing what I was doing, okay? Making sure no one's peeing in the pool. I got my eye on you. I need to take care of that bully. Hey, girl! You guys want to get that bully out of here, don't you? Yeah. I might need your help. Are you sure about this? Yes. I know bullies very well, so just make sure you're eating this, you're drinking this, and I'll take care of the rest. Hey! Are you guys eating in the pool? The only person that's allowed to eat and drink in the pool is Billy. Give me that. Give me that. Hey, uh, Come on. Billy needs a snack. That went exactly according to plan. Hey, Billy! Yeah, what's going on, lifeguard? It's not like you can stop me. You have a whistle. Oh, yeah, you're right. I don't have a whistle, but are those flaming hot Cheetos? And Gatorade. I heard if those are mixed together in your body that it actually attracts sharks. Well, it's a good thing we're in a pool. This is what I was talking about. Ha ha. Good thing. Okay, girls, so do you know the plan? I'll stay right there. And I'll run to the other side. Okay, and remember, start as soon as I yell shark, shark, okay? Okay. Wow, Billy, you drank all your Gatorade and ate all your flaming hot Cheetos. Yeah, just enjoying the pool by myself. Okay, well, I'll just make sure nothing happens to you. Oh my gosh, baby shark! Get out of here! Oh, woo! Oh, oh my god! Congratulations, you figured out who was peeing in the pool. You have earned this. Let's see who I'm coaching. Zadie! You ready to learn some new moves here at my gym? Oh, what's in here? Think you might want to hire me as your coach? Let's go on the slide. Now are you going to go tummy or sit? Yeah. You can do it, Zay. Three, two, one. Go. Go. Great job! Now you're gonna walk on a balance beam, arms out, one foot in front of the other. Woo! Woo! Yeah. You're almost there. Ready, and yay! Good job! High five! Now obviously you'll eventually do a backflip, but today it's just about jumping. Jump, 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 jump. Why am I doing all the work? Oh, good girl. Jump, jump, woo! Great jumping skills, it must be your coach. Now I'm going to teach Sadie how to do a somersault. Arms up, hands down. Now put your head, woo, good girl! You did it! Now I think you need to swing on the bars. You're gonna try to hang on the bar for three seconds. Arms up, one, two, three, woo! Good job! You must have a really good coach, huh? So Zade, am I hired? Yeah. That's a yes. Robbery in progress. You catch a bad guy, you get hired. This is my house. Go get him. Okay. Robber's in my house. Hey, there's a robber. That's why you don't play my well, You can't catch me. Oh, yeah, I can. Rookie, you gotta do better than this. Get back here! Oh. Hey. Not cool! Come on, rookie, pick it up. Let's go! I got go, this! Go! Hey. I saw you went in here, and I am not letting you go! I am not gonna get fired! Come out, because I'm about to arrest you! Where'd they go? Sam Fambina, police officer, is a lot harder than I thought! I swear I thought he went in here! Maybe I'm just gonna have to get fired. Have you guys ever tried to be a police officer? It is a lot harder than it looks. Oh! Hey. oh. Got him! Turn over! 
work. You're under arrest. I did it. Good job, rookie. So does that mean I'm hired? You're hired. Yes! Give me back my play button. I need to figure out what's stuck in his throat so I can get it out. Okay, so it looks like something round is in his trachea. Maybe I can talk to him. Was it a, a penny? A, a round ball? Something like that? Was it a marble? Like you were playing with marbles and you just swallowed it? Oh my gosh, are you okay? We thought that you were in the hospital. Uh, do you know what he what he swallowed? Something stuck in his soul? I'm, I'm so sorry. Okay, I just need to think. Tiffany, I'm not getting fired today. What else is small and round and you can swallow it? A toy? Do you act like a kid? Okay, yeah, it's not kids. Maybe it was a piece of a cookie, like you swallowed the whole oh my thing. God, are you okay? I was so worried. Uh, what are you doing that? Why are you here? Well, I'm his girlfriend. Um, I'm his girlfriend. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, wait, 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 did he call either of you guys and let him know? No, he didn't call. How do they know he's here? Postmates. Postmates. It's hard to find you, but I got your order. Okay, wait. If they didn't call him, how do they all know that he's here at the hospital? What is round and... An air tag. Doctor, he swallowed an air tag. I know just what to do. What? <laughs> Got it. I get it. It was an air tag. She said that she's your girlfriend. Is that true? What? What are you doing? Seriously? Is this Chinese food? Okay, so I'm a babysitter. This should be easy. I just need to find the kids now. Oh, good. There you are. I need to go run some errands, but I need you to keep an eye on my daughter. I don't trust her, and do not let her bring any of her friends over. They are trouble. Okay, where, where, where is your daughter? She's probably in her room. I'll be back in 30. Easy. Babysitting one kid? I got this. Oh, there she is. Hey, you must be Lexi. You must be my babysitter, since obviously my mom doesn't trust me. Oh, no, no, no. She trusts you. And besides, I'm like... Oh, Cool babysitter. Like, I love furry things. Is that like a diary? Yeah. Can I see it really? No, this is mine. Yeah, I just want to see. Mine. Okay. Uh, who's that? What are friends. Uh, no, no, no. Hey, we're here to help. Is this the babysitter? Uh, yes. And I got specific instructions that you can't have people over when she's gone. You guys probably have to go. Sorry. We'll see how long she lasts. Mm -hmm. How long I. What? No, 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 no. This isn't good, Zimpham. What am I going to do? She is not allowed to have friends over, but I do need to gain her trust so that I can get that page from her diary. So, it can't be that bad. You know what? I thought about it, Lexi. And it's totally cool if you have your friends here. In fact, oh. here, let me just hang out. What you guys Snapchatting about? You TikToking? Woo woo! Boom. Do you want to play a game with us? Down, I'm down. Let's do this. You need your phone though. Oh, yeah. Let's go. You ready? Yep. Go, go, go. What's this game? Like an AI thing? Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Why did you do that? Lexi, did you like that? Let's just go watch a movie. Okay. No! Ah, I'm gonna need a new phone. But right now, I have to figure out a way to get that diary. They're talking. Now's my chance to sneak in. So weird. I don't even get it. I know. Yeah, he just goes on and on about the most random things. For real. Like, we're in math class and he's talking about history. Rebecca? Hey, Lexi! Did you just try to take her diary? No, no, no. I was stretching, you guys. As you get older, it's important to keep your limber. Get out of here. Let's go. go. Okay, I'm okay. Okay, okay. Ow, that kernel hit me in my eye. Hey, 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 wait, stop. Sorry, Becca, we were just joking. Oh, thank goodness, you here, guys. Here, have some candy. Oh, this so, is. So, tell oh. us about your day, Rebecca. Okay, well, honestly, I'm not supposed to be letting you guys over here right now, but you guys aren't that bad, and you know, I just wanted to get to know you guys a little bit better, do my job as an amazing babysitter. And do you have something on your leg. What? Do you need to go to the bathroom. What is that? Oh my god! I, I think I got a little nervous when my phone went in the toilet. Get out of here! I'll be back. I'll be back. For real this time. What do you think, Lexi? Mm. This is awkward. <laughs> what? This is Nutella! You're trying to get rid of me. There is no way I'm leaving until I get the page in that diary. So you know what? No more Miss Nutella. What's that? Oh! Oh, God! <coughs> oh, I can't read it! Ah! That was our pie, Rebecca. Yeah, we were, were gonna eat that. that. We're starving. Can you at least get us burgers then? Sure! Can I borrow your phone? Nothing is working right now. I'm trying my best to get that page out of her diary, but if I don't get it before her mom gets home, I am not going to pass this level. I just need to get her to trust me. I just need to figure out how I can do that. Nothing's making her any better. We have to keep on trying, because the last prank we have is pretty epic. I think it will work. Hey, Rebecca. Hey! Where is Lexi? In the bathroom, like, brushing her hair. Lexi, are you crying? No, no, I just got something in my eye. You know, I might have messed up your pie, sorry about that, but these burgers are delicious. Eat up. Can you get us some water? Anything, as long as you trust me. <laughs> <laughs> Okie dokie, pour water 
server's here. Someone grab something. I'm not a server right now. Okay, we've got our waters. We've got our burgers. Now eat up. Can I tell you something? Yeah. What? I actually am kind of starting to like you. You're a really cool babysitter. That means so much to me. I'm so happy that you're starting to trust me. I want to prove to you how trustworthy I am. Let's just eat. Um. It's so you know what? We're not really hungry anymore. Yes. You can just meet us by the pool, Rebecca. I'm pretty sure I didn't order the spicy burgers, but I must have. Did you hear that? She trusts me. I think I'm getting closer to getting to that diary, Sam Fam. What are you guys doing out at the pool? Reading your diary? Lexi's well, starting to trust you, and so are we. So we're thinking about letting you into our friend group. I am in. You can trust me as a babysitter. But to be in our friend group, you have to go through this special secret ritual. Count me in. What do I have to do? You're going to turn around and face us. Three steps back. One, two, three. Are your eyes closed? Yep. Three, two, one. Let's go inside. <laughs> ah, that's not funny, you guys! I cannot believe they did that to me, Zampam! That is... Oh my gosh, Zampam. It's the diary! I can finally pass this level. I just need to get a page. Dear diary, I'm still really sad about breaking up with Kevin. It's been really hard, but at least my friends are here to cheer me up and take my mind off the breakup. Is that why she's been acting this way? She must be so, what are you doing? Did you read my diary? I did, and I'm supposed to take a page from it, but I can't. Listen, breaking up with someone, especially your first love, it is literally the hardest thing. He broke up with me. He doesn't deserve you. Here's your diary. Thank you. Thank you. What are your friends doing inside of the house? I told you no friends, and still you had them over. I knew that I couldn't trust you. You are grounded. No, 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 no. It was me. I invited her friends over. She knew nothing about it. This is your first and last time babysitting my daughter, and you are not getting paid. <sighs> Thanks. You didn't have to do that. No problem. Here. Are you sure? I'm over him anyways. Thanks for being a good babysitter. So I'm a dog walker, and I have to get a gold dog collar. There you are. You're late. You have to get all these dogs to their homes, but you only have 15 minutes left. I sent you all the addresses. If you can do that in 15 minutes, you'll get this gold dog collar. Don't yeah. mess it up. It looks like three of them are going to one house, which means I only have two locations that I have to get to. This is going to be easy. Come on, dogs. Woof, woof. Let's do this. Come on. Come on. You guys are pretty fast. I really need to pass this. I can't get fired. Oh. Hi, baby. Hey, mom. We got everyone. Yep. Thank you. Bye, doggies. Thank you. All right, little guy. It's just me and you, and you are four miles away. I only have 10 minutes left. How am I going to do this? We can just get it over. We don't have to walk. I'm definitely going to pass this damn fam. Oh. Uber for Rebecca? Yes. Okay, perfect. Oh, we are uh, on a time crunch. I, I don't allow dogs. I told myself never again after last time. Hey, whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. What are we supposed to do? There is no way I can get there. And seven. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna have to hitchhike. I am trying to catch a ride, but no one is picking me up. And if I can't drive to this location of this dog's house, then there's no way I can make it in time. Please, stop, 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 stop. Hey, this poor sick dog needs to get home as soon as possible. Do you think that we could get a ride? Yeah, hop in. Thank you. Thank you so much for picking us up. This poor sick dog only has like five minutes left for me to get there. Um, I think I just ran out of gas. No, 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 no. I can't go anywhere. No. I wish I could help you, but I really have to get this job. I can't get fired. Thank you for trying, but I've got to go. Good luck with everything. Come on, let's go. I'm sorry you can't walk, but I have to get you home in time so I can get that dog collar. Thank oh, Amazon delivery. I can just convince them to drive us. That's perfect. Excuse me. I was wondering if you were going on this route at all. Yeah, actually, that is the route that I Oh need my to gosh, could we have a ride? There's no way. I don't we'll have help you with the boxes. Hang on, I have a phone call. Hang on. Hello? Yes. No, I can't do more. I have 50 already. Hey, Zam Fam, I don't want to have to do this, but he said he can't take us and we have no other option. I have to get that collar. I cannot believe it worked. Now his next stop should be where his owner is so I can get that collar. I just cannot let him know that we are hiding in here. He parked, which means all we have to do is get out and run to his owner's house so I can get that collar. Your house is that way. We're gonna do it! Come on. Come on! We are two miles away, but I don't think I can run that fast. Bike! Bike! Hey, 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 wait, wait, stop! I was wondering if I could have your bike. Okay, give me 200. I don't have any money. Is there anything else I can do? I like those shoes. My sister's birthday is coming up. Fine, but I need your backpack too. Ah, doggy, we're getting you home! I'm getting that cold collar! Ah, we're here, dog! Okay, good job. We have like 10 more seconds. Let's go! 
Five, four seconds to spare. Sir, what are you here for today? Well, before I hire you, my hair's been feeling really dry lately. Is there any way you can make it soft? Sounds like you need a deep condition. Just add in a few things, scalp massage. Mm. This is my secret trick, it always. <laughs> the coolest really adds hydration. I feel so cold. Yeah, that's part of the deep condition. Ow! Oh. That's just really cold. Do you want a deep condition or not? As long as it won't be dry. Oh, it's so cold, what are you using? It's a secret ingredient. And voila! Run your fingers through your hair. Tell me how soft it feels. This is so soft. Yeah? This is the softest it's ever felt. Why is my hand pink? I don't think I can do it. Yes, you can after the Rebecca Zamolo karate training. Now everyone stand tall and repeat after me. I, I can, can break, break the, the board. Okay, that last one was not a karate move. Let's see your karate kick. Getting prepped to break that board, karate. Okay, oh yeah. Okay, come on, I want confidence. I want you to kick your foot up in the sky. Oh! Do you think you guys are ready? This is gonna be easy. Focus through the board. Yeah! Oh, nice job! Just remember, straight through, okay? Hiya! Not bad at all! Looks like someone's getting hired. All right, Erica, step on up. You got this. Just like that kick, but with your hand all the way through. Like harder, though. Break it! I can't do it. You know what, you guys, practice your karate move. I'll be right back. Hey, what's going on? I'm sorry, I just couldn't break the board. You can break the board, though. All you need is confidence. You're just not confident, just like that last kick you did. You just have to do that, the same thing. But how? You just have to think of the board as something, okay? And use that to drive your hand all the way through. Well, what am I supposed to think of? She can't do it. She's just a girl, she can't do it. Quiet! Did they just say that? Girls can do anything that boys can do. Now use that and break that board. You got this! I hope she's got this. Okay, Erica, are you ready? Put an extra board on there. Are you sure? Yes. You've got this. Remember what to think of. You just go on through. You can do this. Oh! How'd she do that? What? I did it because girls can do anything that boys can do. You can give me a good massage blindfolded. You're hired. I can do that. My right dance good. What if I go down on the legs? Yeah, I'm on my legs all day. All right, as long as I get hired, to do anything. You're doing good. How are your hands? You want a My hand hands massage? Are a little bit tense now that you mentioned okay. it. Okay. Oh wow. Yeah. You're wearing gloves? Keep them nice and soft. Any other parts of the body you want a massage for? My face has been a little bit tense recently. Okay, let me just find the, oh there we go. Oh, like a head massage? Yeah, that's good. Wow, you got some kind of coarse curly hair? Yeah, I gotta condition them all. I'm not judging, I'm just trying to massage so I can be hired. You know what? That was a great massage. You're hired! Really? Oh my gosh, thank you so much! What's the problem? I have to get each of you to do a specific yoga pose if I want to be hired. You are up first. Okay, show me your down dog. Put your hands here, yep, and then put your feet here, remember? Woohoo, like that. Okay, we call this the Superman. And now, can I get you to go up? Up? Up, yes, yes, oh, okay, good. Hands down and behind up, you know what? That's excellent, why don't you just rest there in that yoga pose? That is called the tired kitten. Let's have you two stand up, please. Maddie, I would like you to do a Natara Jasana. What's that, yoga instructor? It says a scale on one foot. You lean forward and you balance. Just go with the zen. There, excellent, excellent. Now can you push your body and mind even more? Stretch a little deeper. Ow, 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 ow. Feel the burn. I feel the burn. Well then you learn. I'm gonna let go of you, do not fall. Okay. Yeah! Oh. Boom! Last but not least, let's do this, Matt. Us yogis like to call this a trichona sauna. So you're going to want to straddle. Arms are out. You're going to want to reach to the sunset and then go down, touch the toe, and reach to the skies above. Can you do it? I can try. I will help guide you as a yoga instructor. Arms are out. Reach to the sunset. Oh. And now touch the ground. It's not a good idea. No, no, you, you should do it. Just, ah. just reach, you got this. Yeah. What happened? Oh. Did you pull something? Oh! Oh! oh. oh. Uh, he's president of the United States. I hereby declare everything to be made pink, just like my suit, including this room. Uh, excuse me. <laughs>
excuse me, Mrs. President? Yes. You've just been fired. What? How? You got voted out, ma'am. By who? The American people. What? They can't do that! Uh, yes they can. It is a democracy. If I'm not president, then who is? Me. As president, I'm eliminating all pink. What? No. Ah! What? Say Adams? You're hired as my vice president. What am I supposed to do as vice president? Wait around until I die. Okay, so I'm in a restaurant and I have to find a necklace. What are you doing just standing there? Do something! Oh, uh, don't listen to her. She's been here so long she thinks she owns the place. Hey, 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 hey! Somebody serve table 10! I want her out of here! Special order, table number 10. Can you take table 10? I'm slammed. Sure. I'm sorry, but it's just not gonna happen. Here you guys go. What a pretty necklace. It's beautiful. He could never afford it. <laughs> and enjoy your meal! Sam fam, did you see that? That's the necklace I have to get. Oh my god, what's going on? You guys, dead body! Someone here did this! Whoever did took my necklace! It's worth $10,000! That's my best friend, Sean! Travis, what are you doing here? Daniela, what are you doing here? I work here. I think he was poisoned! Or he was murdered! With a deadly weapon! Well, whoever it was was wearing gloves. I felt it on my neck. Look! The doors are locked and the killer is still mm. here. Complete the challenges or the consequences will be severe. Locked? We're locked! 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 Who is she anyway? It's my new girlfriend. Yeah, he upgraded. How long have you been working here anyways? It's been a week. You better not have taken her necklace. I didn't before and I didn't now. Whoever did this is apparently wearing gloves and I want to get my necklace back. There's another page. There's a map to different challenges. It says complete the challenges or the consequences will be severe. If we don't complete these challenges... Then we might die. Challenge one is over there. Look! Challenge one. First to find the spatula wins. Him. I have to find that spatula. Where do you think it is? So we have to get that necklace. Whoever killed that customer is definitely the one with the necklace. I gotta get out of here or I'm next. Where's the spatula? I'm gonna go check the freezer. Okay, you do that. There's no way there's a spatula here. I know every inch of this place. I'm scared your ex is gonna kill me next. Don't worry, babe. I'm not gonna let anything happen to you. Stay right here. Look for the spatula. Where's the spatula, you guys? I have to be the first to find it. Where is this? Oh my God. Guys, I found it! I found the spatula! You found the spatula! Yeah. Where's my girlfriend? My girlfriend? I don't know. Where is she? Oh no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no. No, no, babe. It was you! She knew this would happen. It was you! Oh, I didn't kill her! Where's the shaft? Dead body! Dead body? <gasps> oh no! It looks like she was poisoned just like the other one! You obviously killed her! I was in the freezer. You definitely killed my girlfriend. And you two never got along! You could have killed both of them! I want my necklace back! You can't do that! She <laughs> What does it say? It's a note. The killer knows every inch of the restaurant. See? It could have been me. I'm new. But you, you own the place. Me, you up. I know the restaurant. It's my place. Hey, we're there. No, okay. Okay. We can't just keep making accusations. We need proof. We need to keep going. Challenge number two is that way. And hopefully, no one else dies. Sam, Sam, I'm really nervous right now. I have no idea who the killer is, but I have to find out who it is and get that necklace or I don't pass this level. Challenge two. Don't choose the wrong straw. Everyone must take turns sipping from one straw or else. No. There's no way I'm doing this. There's a chance we could drink poison. Why? Because you're the killer? I'm not the killer. My boss is. What are you talking about? It says or else. We're obviously going to get killed if we don't. Who wants to go first? All right, fine. Step aside. Step aside. <laughs> it's iced tea. <sighs> okay, who wants to go next? I'll do it. It burns. That looks like hot sauce. It's hot, but at least it's not poison. The chances of us getting the poison are going up right now. I better give him my best jab. Carbonated beverage. Of course you didn't get the poison. Oh. Sour. Gatorade. Who's left? Just you and me. Do you want to just go at the same time? One, two, three. It's sour. <gasps> oh my god. That is like lemon joe. Oh no! She drank the poison! Alright, we need to keep going. Where's the map? Another person just died. Challenge number three is that way. She just died. That could have been me. And I still don't know who the killer is. I really hope I can figure this out and find out where that necklace is. It looks like this is spill your guts or fill your guts. You have to pour milk into one of these coffee cups. And whatever food it says you have to eat or you have to reveal a secret about someone in this group. I'll go first. Please don't be something gross. Dead bugs? I'm gonna eat it. Oh gosh. It's fine. <sighs> Oh, that's disgusting. Uh, oh, I feel like a reptile. If I get bugs, there's no way I'm eating that. What does it say? Raw octopus. Oh, 
No way. I'll, I'll reveal a secret. Someone here is a collector of fine jewelry. That explains why somebody stole my necklace. Okay, who's up? I'll go. Move over. <laughs> Whoa. Pizza cupcake? Bon appetit. Oh, is it good? I wouldn't even serve this as someone I want dead. You should know by now I'm not eating anything disgusting. Then we're gonna reveal more secrets. Chicken feet, absolutely not. Person who died is the son of someone who works here. And he doesn't even care. How is your son that died? It was my best friend. It's my turn now. I will eat anything. I will tell any secret. I don't care. I'm just glad to be alive. Eliminated? Whoa, what's going on? Hey! hey quit moving around. Who did that? What? He died! God, he's dead. How did that happen? What? You were right by him. I, I didn't do anything. I didn't see anything. I, I just... felt you moving. He got eliminated. Obviously, you lost. Let's keep moving. Where's the map? He died. Next challenge. Looks like the next challenge is that way. Let's go. This is McDonald's food versus restaurant food. There are two burgers in front of us, and we have to decide which one is from the restaurant and which one's from McDonald's. All we can do is take a bite. If you guess wrong, you're out. Winner gets to make an accusation. I'm a chef. I was made for this. Point to the burger you think is from McDonald's. Easy, dry, tough, and disgusting. Lift up your plates. <gasps> yes! You're out. I guess dinner was served. Now it's french fries. Eat up. Hey! Oh no, oh no, did someone die? <sighs> Everyone's alive. Okay. But well, what about the chef? The chef? I'm right here. I guess we just continue the challenge. I still don't know who the killer is, but if I don't win this challenge, then I'm not gonna be able to get that necklace. These ones are saltier. <coughs> okay. <coughs> hey! Mm. Hey! No, 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 I did Did you just kill him? No! no. You gotta keep playing. The winner gets to make an accusation. It wasn't me, I promise it was not me. Okay, okay choose McDonald's fries. You're out if you're wrong. Hey. We both got it. Now it is milkshakes. Mm. I think the McDonald's is definitely the orange no. one, green. Rebecca wins. She gets to make the accusation. It is time. Accusation. Now, most of the people died from poison, but I'm gonna have to say that you, me, you are the killer. I saw you sneak past Danielle and go into the kitchen where the other waitress was killed, and then I saw you use the back entrance to kill Travis's girlfriend. When the lights went off in the coffee competition, you were conveniently on the edge, which made it very easy for you to go and kill the boss. And finally, I saw some green liquid right next to your finger, coincidentally, right after Travis died. I I think that you are the one who killed Sean in the beginning, and I think you faked taking your necklace. Bravo, bravo. You figured it all out, didn't you? Well, I was trying to buy this place. And you know what happened when I asked? He said no. So here you go, little missy. <laughs> now I'm all Santa, and since Santa's extremely busy, I'm gonna help Santa out and find out what kids want for Christmas. Looks like I've got my first one. Okay, little girl, what would you like from Santa? Uh... Would you like a pony? Yeah. Okay, I think I can make that happen. Stay on the nice list. Your parents will be happy if you do. Well, that wasn't that bad. Now let's see who the next kid is. Ho, 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 little girl. Why don't you tell me what you want for Christmas? You're not even real. Yes, I am. If you're the real Santa, where are your reindeer? They sleep during the day because they work all night. They are very tired. And why do you have long eyelashes? Santa takes a lot of vitamins, so they grow very fast. I don't believe you. If I wasn't the real Santa, how could I have a belly like this? A pillow. No way, definitely not a pillow. It's my stomach, because I'm jolly and happy like Santa. Why is it soft? Because I eat a lot of sweets. If you're the real Santa, what did you get me for Christmas last year? I got you that really good gift you wanted. You're welcome. Yeah, which one? The good one. Was it an accessory or a toy? It was the accessory toy. I I think your beard and hair are an accessory. What? No, no, no! Ah! 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 See, you're not the real Santa. Ah! My work is done. Now I'm a party planner and I have to throw the perfect party. Nasia, what do you think? I did a circus thing. Ring toss, right there. Okay, you get the point though. They're supposed to land on there. We've got popcorn, balloons. We've got a clown. Look. Yes. He <laughs> See? So, what do you think? I wanted a princess theme, not this. But you said you wanted something fun. Princesses are more fun. This is fun. Look, I'm a cat. Meow, meow. I'm having fun. That's it. Like a carnival theme, but 
She wants a princess theme. I don't know what I can do. The guests are gonna be here any minute, but we're gonna have to make this work. Starting with the cake. Sometimes you need to just be a little creative, especially when you're on a time crunch. And the princess cake is complete. Now, instead of ring toss, I'm gonna do princess toss. Oh, there's one more thing I have to do. I'm gonna need to give this clown a makeover. Are you kidding me? I can't do this. Just let it go. Come on. Hey, Zadie, can I borrow a couple of these? This one, this one, this one. Can I borrow this one? Thanks, you can keep this one. Actually, I might need them all. Are you done? My friends are gonna be here any minute. Well, look, Nastia. We've got a pink cake. We've got princess accessories. We don't have a ring toss, but we have a tiara toss. Look, made it. And finally, Nastia, we don't have a clown. We have Princess Elsa. So, what do you think? I don't like it. <sighs> Thank goodness, can I get out of here? I'm gonna go home and eat my sushi. Oh, sushi? I love sushi. Oh, okay, then. Here, you can have your Thank sushi. You. So, what do you think? You are hired. Yes. You see this decibel reader? You are not a librarian yet. What? These three kids come in every day and cause a ruckus and scare away customers. You need to get this under 45 decibels or you're fired. You have five minutes. Five minutes? They're kids. This can't be that hard. What does nuclear explosion happen <clears throat> in 1982? Excuse me. Could you keep your voice down? We're in a library. This is a public library. I can do whatever I want. Yes, but to respect everyone else, could we just lower our voice? And then you can go back to picking out your books. Sorry, lady. No. Is there anything I can do to just get you to lower your voice down, you know, for everyone? I mean, you could pay me $100. There's no way it's worth $100. I'm just going to keep on being loud then. Hey, hey. Hold on, here, take it, okay? Just keep your voice down, okay? This isn't a hundred dollars. It's all I have. No. Hey, does everyone say twenty dollars is the same as a hundred? Hey, okay, that's all I have. Is there anything else I can do to get you to lower your voice down? I mean, those shoes look like a hundred dollars. Now, not another peek from you. That boy was awful. This girl's gonna be easy. Oh, I do love this song. <laughs> What's that? smell? Nothing. I'm pretty sure it smells like dirty socks. You know what? That's not important. I'm here because this is a library and you cannot play music in a library unless you're wearing your headphones. So could you please just wear your headphones? Aww. No. Okay, I see. Why don't you just read a book? You don't have to listen no. to me. No. I'm going to play my music whether you like it or not. What am I going to do? It's definitely over the decimal reader of 45 and I cannot get fired. So I have to figure out a way to get her to stop. I know something that all kids hate. Hey. Nice song you got there. Give me my phone back. Oh, you want this back? I'm not giving you your phone back unless Ugh. you agree to listen to music with your headphones. Do you want it back? Ugh. Too short, too short? <sighs> Promise me you'll use your headphones. Fine. Get the headphones. Give me the cord. Put it on. Now if I hear that music one more time playing, I'm throwing that phone in a toilet. Yeah, I'm watching. <sighs> Two down, one to go. This is a lot harder than I thought, but I am not kidding. Excuse me, this is a library. Can I ask you to put the chips away? Huh. That was easy. Gum. Uh, <laughs> just backtracking you. Uh, the gum, we don't really allow gum. It makes a loud sound and the decimal reader is definitely reading over 45. So can I get you to also not have chips or gum? You said don't eat chips. Yeah, and, and gum, you just spit it out. No. You know what? I didn't want to have to do this, but you like a good challenge? Mm. I challenge you to a bubble gum blowing contest. If I win, you have to spit out that gum. What happens if I win? I'll leave. Deal. Go first. You nervous? Oh, you think I can't blow a bubble bigger than that? <laughs> oh yeah! Look who blew the biggest bubble, now spit it out. Oh. I have to teach Zadie three new moves. Let's go! The first move I have to teach Zadie is how to just move herself across the pool. Now you're here and you have to go there. Just move your arms. Oh! Look, Zambam, she's doing it! Almost there, Zade. Almost there. And she did it! The next thing I'm teaching Zadie is how to slide it down this into the water. Do you want to slide? Okay. Slide and whoo! <laughs> Good girl! You did it! Now the third and final move is Zadie's gonna have to kick. So her arms are gonna be here. I want you to kick, Zadie. Kick, kick, kick. Woo! Kick, 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 kick. Good girl! Zadie, you just learned three new skills today. I'm a summer school teacher. The golden apple. The only way you're gonna get that is if you get all of us to graduate. All four of us. 
Oh no. It looks like if you want to pass the four challenges to graduate, you all are going to have to work together. Statistically, I have better odds of achieving that myself. No one wants to work with you anyway, nerd. Hey, oh, you're messing up my hair. Hey, hey. Oops, I missed. Let's get started with challenge one. This is math, the box punching challenge. You have to guess which box is empty, and if you want to graduate, you as a group have to get five out of the eight right. Jock, you're up first. Choose which box you think is empty. Pretty easy, because this one just moved. Three. Two, one. Go! Oh, oh my goodness! What a fool! I knew she was in that box. <laughs> oh. Don't worry, you guys. You got one wrong. You still have seven more tries. You've got this. That felt good. Can I stay in the box the whole time? No. You have to graduate too. Okay, nerd, pick your box. And by nerd, I mean that in a good way. Is there any other way? <laughs> well, statistically, right-handed people are most likely to choose the right box, and he was right-handed, so I'll take this one. <laughs> So predictable, oh. you buffoon. Oh, predict this, oh, 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 oh. Hey, Popular girl, you're up next. Uh, she can go first. Die. Okay, I'll go. <laughs> All right, class, you've gotten one right, which means you only need four more to pass this challenge. You guys can do it. Florals are super in right now, so I'll do this one. Three, two, one. You can't even break wrapping paper, nerd. At least my face is still flawless. Okay, that has never happened before. Is your hand okay? Three to six days of recovery should fix it. It's wrapping paper. I hate both of these, but that one has more pink, so. Three, two, one. That means that you guys got another one right, which means you need only three more to pass. High five. Hey. No. Round two, Jock, pick your box. I'm telling you, if you want to win this, you pick that one. Oh, really? Three, two, one! Oh! God. Come on, we have to start working together to get this right. Not to put the pressure on you guys, but you only have three more tries, which means you have to get all three right if you want to pass this challenge. And I want to get that apple, so work together, okay? It's obvious he'll try to use reverse psychology this time. I'll choose this one. Three, two, one! <laughs> Predictable. Hey, you should be happy. He got it right, which means we are closer to winning. Victory punch. Yeah. No, 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 no. Popular girl. You both have to get this right if you guys want to pass this challenge. Well, I'm pretty sure the nerd said something about right-handed people choosing the right box, and I saw him holding the pencil in his right hand when he was breathing on my neck. Okay. So, three, two, one. Oh. Oh. Okay, you guys, you just need to get this last one right, and you won't pass this challenge. It all comes down to goth girl. Oh, jeez. If you get this right, that means that all of you guys are moving on to the next challenge. Whatever. Three, two, one. Oh! You passed challenge one. Now it's time to move on to challenge two. I hope it involves dead animals. This is PE, the cup race challenge. You guys have to work together to get 20 cups on this table only using your balloons. You guys have one minute. Time starts now. They have to get this right now or I'm not gonna get that golden apple. Jock is doing dude, he's got two cups. What? Did she just knock those over? Everyone else is trying, she's the only one that's not. I have no idea why. But if she doesn't start helping them out, we're not gonna get them to graduate. Keep going, you guys. Even the nerd's able to do this challenge. Five, four, three, two, one, time. The nerd has four. Jock has 11. All we need is five. One, two, three, four, five, six. You guys did it! Challenge two is complete! They really don't like each other, do they? This is social studies, and you're throwing a dart at a map and guessing the brand of that state. If you get it wrong, you have to go in the shop roulette. There are three rounds. You guys have to get six total to pass. Throw your dart. If this is designer brands, this will be so easy. Louis Vuitton, easy. That is correct! No shocker for me. Sun kissed. Wrong! That's Walmart! What? Clearly one of the biggest stores in the United States! A mogo. Head to Shocker Roulette. Let's go, goth girl. You got this. Idaho! I don't know! Oh, everyone knows this. You got this. Death. No, it's Target! Shocker Roulette! Let's do this, nerd. You got it! Oh, that's close, but it looks like it's California! Okay. Well, everyone knows that. Greatest inventor of our generation, Steve Jobs. This is the Apple logo, of course. That's a point. <laughs> Thank you, Teach. We have two points, but now it's time for the Shocker Roulette. You two got it wrong, but hopefully you have a little bit better luck with roulette. <laughs> if it lands, you'll know. 
Oh, that wasn't bad. Was it, dare I say, shocking? <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Sorry I said that. Round two, and you guys have four more that you need to get right. That shocker is terrifying. There is no way I'm doing that. <gasps> okay. Now I know it's hard, but just think about it before you say what it is. Gucci, obviously. Yes, three points, you guys. Three more to go. Whoa. Come to Papa. Nike. Correct. Just do it. You've got this. Washington. This one everybody knows. You guys, comment below if you know what this is. Death. Starbucks. Why do I feel like she's not trying? Oh wait, because she isn't. And I need to figure out why. <laughs> Should I move? <laughs> right on the button. Who goes for Montana? It's the greatest state. Oh, think Great. hard. Space station? No! Converse. Shock roulette. This is not going as planned, and if I don't get them to graduate, I am not getting that golden apple. Before I go, though, why are you guys even here in summer school? I would never turn on extracurricular learning. Anything to get away from my family. Oh, man. <laughs> Looks like you guys got lucky, but now it is round three, and you guys need two more if you want to pass. I don't care. Why would you not care? This is our education. Oh, no. This is the speed round. All of you guys at once and remember at least two of you have to get your answers right everyone throw in three two one let's go let's go you Colorado nerd <laughs> say the brand Florida Gator football no it's Crocs head to the shocker Macy's correct duff you had to have known that everyone knows Amazon right Sam Sam any intelligent person would know this is Tesla yes we did it we won congratulations you guys you guys got six right which means you passed social now head on down for challenge number four. Except for you, just real quick. Hey, she forgot the shocker. <laughs> hey, I wanted to talk to you. You're not really trying in any of the challenges. I'm not good at any of them. What are you good at? I have a sixth sense. You mentioned you're at summer school because you don't want to be with your family. What do you not like about your family? They always leave me out of things. I know your classmates are very different from you, but they've included you in every challenge and they've tried for you in every challenge. So I don't know, maybe that means something. Maybe. Can I leave now? Yep, go ahead and head down to challenge number four. Okay, Sam Fam, I really hope that works because if we don't have her help in the next challenge, I don't know if they're gonna graduate. This is a squid game challenge. At least one of you needs to make it across without choosing the wrong box. If you complete this challenge, then you guys will be able to graduate. Draw your numbers. Three. Number one. Square root of four. Four. She's four, we're never gonna graduate summer school. Line up, you guys. Oh man. You've got this. Use your stats to get through this. Oh, oh, uh, don't worry, you guys. We still have a 50-50 chance. And we've got Mr. Athletic right here. Let's go. Easy first step. Easy yes. second one. Yeah! <laughs> Keep it going. Two more. Ah! Oh, dang. No pressure, but it's all up to you. Listen, goth girl, I know this isn't all like black and dead and stuff, but this is the only way that we're going to get out of here. So I'm begging you, put in some effort. OK, that's a good step. Okay, she was paying attention. Okay, I know you've got a sixth sense, right? You talk to dead people. Oh! You did it, God girl! You guys carried me through the other challenges. It was the least I could do. Besides, I have some dead animals to bury. Yes! We love dead animals! It has been quite the journey, but I am excited to announce you all have graduated summer school. And we wanted to announce that this is your golden apple. You will be competing in a fashion show where you design your own look. But you can only use whatever's on that table. You have five minutes. What are you just standing there for? Go! What? Oh. Okay. What is this? Sorry, I can't let you win. I need a hundred dollars! Yeah, you're not getting hired today. What? No! You guys, that's not fair! Maddie, let me have one of them! Sorry, figure it out on your own! What? That's not fair! All I have is a deck of cards. What am I supposed to do? I can only use stuff on this table. There's tape? Balloons? I think I have an idea. They say one man's trash is another man's treasure. I'm gonna make sure that this is the best ever. I actually saw this on TikTok. You just make a little slit on this side right here. It opens up everything and voila, you have fashion. And guess what? It's also waterproof. I have all these supplies, but all I need is this aluminum foil to make a DIY dress. I saw this on TikTok and if I can just tape the cards together, I can make a dress and then these balloons? I've done something cool with this before in my hair. Time's up. Let's see what outfits you've designed. What inspired you for this look? The future inspired me. Next. Oh. 
what was the inspiration for this? I just wanted something a little bit more trashy and super airy. Next. Wow, I've never seen anything like this. What inspired you? I went with a Las Vegas theme and I was hoping that would make me a little bit lucky. Indeed it does. Everyone over here now. Well, it was a difficult decision, but the winner is... Rebecca. I did it, damn it! Oh my God, I'm blowing! I have to be my husband around the pool if I want to be hired. You marks, get set, go! <laughs> This summer camp is guys only. Yeah. Should have taken a on nail polish and Barbie. I told you not to come. Yeah, get your pink backpack and leave. <laughs> Look at that. What is this? What's going on? They said I can't be at summer camp because I'm a girl. What? That's not fair. They don't think girls are good enough. Girls can do anything guys can do. Yeah, well, I gotta go. What? No, that's not fair. How am I going to do this? I'm supposed to be camp counselor of the year, but I'm a girl. I have to think of something to do. What is this? Campfire play costumes? Sam, fam, are you thinking what I'm thinking? If I can't beat the boys, I'll become a boy. Every time. 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 Take you to grow that. I shaved this morning. Ooh. Now get down, pretty boy. Uh, come on, man. Come on, you can do it. Down. You got this. All right, listen up. I'm your camp counselor. Today there's gonna be four challenges. The last man standing will be the camp counselor of the year, and you will win this manly medal. The first challenge is archery. Who's ever farthest away from the bullseye is eliminated. Easy! Uh. Uh, uh, Let's go. First up, my man Jet. Yeah. Jet. Let's go, boy. Oh, sorry about that. The guns. How are we supposed to win with this new guy here? To be the best, you gotta compete against the best. Don't be scared, little lady. Not bad. Beat that. Easy. This is not gonna be easy. It's not like I'm Katniss this ever Dean. All right, let's do this. In the red, that's manly. Pretty good, but it's not like it's yellow because I'm mellow yellow. Well, let's see how you do. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, you want to see how no, I do? No, 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 no. Here you go. Just take it. Yeah, that's right. This mustache didn't grow yesterday. Grew this morning, right after I shaved. So glad that girl's not here. She wouldn't even hit the target. Hey, that's my sister. Oh, <clears throat> no offense. Time for this man to show you boys how to hit a target. I got it. Oh, and that's how you do it like a real man. Only a man could do that. We instantly have a front runner in this competition of men. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. yeah. My disguise as a boy is working. I might actually win this camp counselor of the year. Boy, he's one of us. Of course I am. I'm a man. In the blue, this little boy needs some more meat in his diet. Right, nice job. Blue's just two away from yellow right here. Oh. Right there. Man, you're strong. I know, it's the stash, really. Alpha time! Oh, oh. Oh. Redo. Men don't do redos. Looks like you didn't hit the bullseye. You are eliminated. Oh, why's your mustache so good? Grip it and rip it. Let's go. Rip what are we ripping? Oh, you What's guys, it? come on. Grow up. Yeah. So, uh, what do you think about your sister getting kicked out of summer camp? I don't know. I feel like she would have beat all of us. Really? No way. She's a girl. Yeah, she doesn't belong here. Yeah, I'd never get beaten by a girl. Yeah, yeah. especially in archery, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, he just went up to you. Uh. <laughs> Don't mess with the stash. Yeah, man. Okay, I want to back off. This is the race. Now the potato sack race. This will determine your position in the next challenge. Let's do this, men. Ready, men, go! Oh, yeah! I'd like to thank this stash and the fact that I am a man winning this. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh. 
<laughs> Next challenge, tug of war. Since this man won the potato sack race, he gets to pick his partner. This is an important decision because if I pick the wrong partner, I could be eliminated. But I also want to choose someone that wouldn't judge me if they find out my true identity. I'm going with this guy. Yeah, yeah, I'm partnered with the stash. Let's go. Yeah. Whoever falls in the slime pool is eliminated. Ready, men, tug. <laughs> Come on, we gotta win this. How are we supposed to beat the stash? Well, there's only one stash and two of us. I don't think I can do this. You need to not give up and pull this rope like your sister would pull when I say three. Are you ready? One, two, three, pull. <laughs> You two are eliminated. You two move on to the next round. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry about that, boys, but that's how real men do it. Yeah, yeah. men. I need that stash. Final challenge, survival hacks. The first man to break out of his rope wins the entire competition. May the best man win. Ready, men? Escape! Uh. Oh. 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 oh, oh, yeah! yeah. yeah. That's not a man, that's a woman! Wait a second, Whoa. wait! That's a fake mustache! You didn't grow that this morning! You're a woman, you're disqualified! That's not fair! This man wins! No, wait, I thought Camp Counselor of the Year was supposed to be the best. She beat us at every challenge. She deserves to win. You're right. This woman won fair and square. She is the real champion. Oh my gosh! Are you ready to go to the zoo? Whoa! Look at all the animals! That's a snake. That's a tiger. What about this? This is an elephant. Ooh, I'm an elephant. A hippopotamus? Where is the giraffe? Oh, is this a giraffe? Hi, Zadie. I love you. Oh, the monkey. What does the monkey say? Hi. Hi? The monkeys don't say hi. We have to block three of the five goals if I want to be hired. Has she ever been a goalie before? I don't think she's ever played soccer before, but we're not going easy on her. Kick up! Let's go! Oh. Come on! I played soccer for nine years. Oh no. Nine years! Oh! Hey! Why is there Velcro on these gloves? There you go. Oh yeah. Blocked it. My turn! Hey, hey, what? Ah! Ah! I wasn't ready! Ah! Oh no, it all comes down to this. If I block it, I'm hired, but if I don't, I'm fired. Okay, I've got this damn thing! find the girl, true love, and get the heart. That must be the girl. Hey, Rebecca, do you think you can help me restock the cups? Of course. Okay, well, where do these go? Right under here. Got it. The ice cream's already scooped, so we should be ready to go. That sounds great. Well, 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 Steph. Look at these ceilings. You did not clean the ceilings last night. These cups, you need to clean up those cups. I don't want ah. dirty cups on my counters, and it's your fault. You better start training this new girl correctly, especially if you want that vacation time. And I better see clean ceilings when I get back here. Okay. I've been working overtime for this vacation. I really want to go. Why would you let him talk to you like that? I mean, all of those things you didn't even do. Yeah, but he's my boss and whatever he says goes. How do you even clean a ceiling? Tell me about it. <laughs> what is that? It's a heart. It keeps me calm when I'm nervous. <laughs> Your heart. <laughs> Smiling at you. Oh, he's a regular. Hey, stuff. Hey, the usual one scoop of chocolate in a cone in, in a, a cup. cup. <laughs> you got it. You have the best memory out of everyone I've ever met. No, oh, no, I don't. That'll be five dollars. Thanks. That guy seems like he kind of likes you. Oh, he's just friendly. I think he might have a crush. I mean, he might be your true love. Oh, that's impossible. Why? Because I have a boyfriend. A boyfriend? Uh, I'm gonna drop this off really quick. Okay, I'll take the order. Hi, how can I help you? Oh, uh, you can't help me. Give me my girlfriend pronto. Your girlfriend? Yes. I don't know who your girlfriend is. Hey babe, what are you doing here? Oh, I'm here 
here because there was crust on my PB and J this morning. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I, I was working late last night and I overslept. Save it and give me some ice cream. Okay. That's your boyfriend? Yeah, uh, he's really mad I messed up his sandwich. He shouldn't be talking to you like that. No, it's my fault. I messed it up. See, fam, I cannot believe that her boyfriend talked to her that way. I know if I want to beat this program, I have to find her true love. And I really think that guy is not it. Here's your vanilla cone, babe. I got it just I'm for you. I'm not going to hold it. That's a dirty napkin. Balance it. Balance the cone. Come on. Hey, she doesn't have to here. I got you. Oh. oh, great. Now there's a mess. Oh, whoa. That wrist is looking thick. Did you skip the gym this morning? I told you I overslept. Whoa, we agree three a week or we don't speak. But, uh, oh. And you better be ready for that vacation. Are you? Yeah, I've been working overtime. I told you I saved up for it. I'm especially. telling you right now, I'm kissing a girl on that vacay, whether it's you or not. I gotta go. And at least one of us is keeping our body tight. Okay, I'm sorry, but your boyfriend is a jerk. He's not. He's just right. Are I, you kidding me? I deserve what he said. What? No, 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 no. You are a catch. You have great qualities, and if he can't see them, then he doesn't deserve you. Qualities like what? Just trust me. Come here. Excuse me, what is your name? Kyle. Kyle. I am trying to convince her how lucky any guy would be to have her. Do you have like three qualities you could say about her that you really like? Yeah, she's funny, she's smart, she's kind. See? Uh, I should get back to work. What? You heard what Kyle said about you. Those are three great qualities that you have. He was just being friendly. But that's not true. And by the way, the way your boyfriend talks to you is not okay. No one should be talking to you like that. He's a really great guy. It just takes time to get to know him, you know? Are you kidding me right now? There are a million guys out there that would talk to you so much better. Why don't you just break up with him? Because I'm not good enough, okay? Listen, no, 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 listen. That's not true. You are good enough, okay? Let me prove it to you. I'll take care of all of this ice cream stuff. I just want you to sit down and have a conversation with Kyle. And at the end of it, I want you to compare how you feel after that conversation versus how you feel when your boyfriend talks to you. Trust me. This is gonna be so much harder than I thought. She doesn't think she's good enough and I'm really hoping this conversation with Kyle will give her the confidence she needs to break up with her boyfriend and find true love. This job's hard. Hey, is it cool if I sit? Yeah, have a seat. Okay, Zamfam, she's sitting down. Do you think that this is going to work? Um, I haven't seen you on Roblox in a while. Yeah, I've been working overtime. My boyfriend doesn't really like it. Bummer, because those worlds you created were so intricate. Really? I've been learning a lot more about coding. <laughs> it's working! She just put down the heart. She looks like she's really into the conversation and she's smiling. Well, well, well. Little Miss napping on the job. Why are you sitting down? No, no, no. She's on break. I'm covering for her. Not anymore. You gotta clean up these cups. Fix it. Are you okay? Can I help you? Uh, no, no, no. It's okay. It's my fault. It's not your fault here. Thank you. Come on. Definitely her true love and I need to get her to break up with her boyfriend but first I need to build her confidence and that means standing up to her horrible boss first why would you let your boss talk to you like that especially when he blames you for things you didn't even do I don't want to get fired I need this job besides I've been working overtime for this vacation people only treat you the way you feel like you deserve to be treated I don't deserve to be treated any better than I am what are you crazy I want you to do an exercise with me okay I want you to imagine yourself at 10 years old what would happen if that boss came in and talked to that little 10 year old like the way he talks to you. Well, I would tell him to stop talking to her like that. She doesn't deserve that. Exactly. So if that 10 year old girl doesn't deserve to be treated that way, why do you now? I don't. So you need to stand up for yourself. But I might get fired. You might get fired or you might show him that he can't talk to you and treat you that way. Okay. Okay? You can do this. What's going on here? This table's not clean. We just cleaned it. It's perfectly clean. It is not clean. You need to clean it. But it's clean. Well, look again. <gasps> clean it up again, Steph. You can do this. You clean it. What? I said you clean it. You spilled it. I guess that's fair. I saw your request for vacation days, and I approved it. <sighs> yes. <laughs> I'm going to go clean the ceilings. Did you see that? You didn't get fired and you stood up for yourself! Oh, that felt so good. It does great because your boyfriend's walking in right now. <gasps> you can do this. Break up with him. I hope this works, Sam fam. So I thought about it and you need to be in the gym six times this week or we're done. I I'm not gonna do that. Oh, uh, what was that? I said I'm not gonna do that. I'm uh, breaking up with you. What did you say? She said she's breaking up with you! For what? Were you gonna run off to a body this time? Are you kidding me? I, I deserve so much better. Well, good luck finding it. Get out! You did it! You did it! You are right. You deserve so much. 
much better. And there's a guy over there that I think can treat you so much better. Sam Pam, this is it. I am so excited. She stood up to her boss. She broke up with her boyfriend. And now she is about to find true love. And I will pass this love. Hey. Hey, Steph. I just wanted to tell you that I really like you. And I wanted to thank you for always being so nice to me. So I was wondering if you want to go on a date. Oh, um, no. I mean. What? Why would she say no? I'm supposed to be finding her true love. Not today. Not tomorrow. But maybe someday. Thank you for helping me find my true love. But you just turned down the date. I did. But the person I love is myself. I'm finally learning to love her now. So, thank you. You love yourself. I'm so happy for you. Okay, Zadie, I did a ton of different jobs, and now it's time for you to choose what you want to be. Which of the jobs? This. This? Looks like Zadie's gonna be a party planner. Get ready for her second birthday. Bye.